Let's go. What is up guys, uh, Jason's here. Before this video starts, you know I always like to mention the free Discord cook group. It's available for you guys to join. It's a great server with lots of monitors, early links, very friendly community group, and a bunch of more stuff you do not want to miss out. I will leave that link down in the description below so you guys can join up. Anyways, let's move on to today's shoot. So we're going to be talking about the new Nike SB Dunk Highs times the Paul Rodriguez collaboration. That releases on Tuesday the 21st at 9 of the morning. So it releases this month, by the way. Um, yeah, because January is a really dry month. But I guess they're kind of like putting in shoes at the end of January, which is not bad. But I'm waiting more for February and March. But um, yeah, let's talk about the design of the Nike SB Dunk High. So these are inspired by Mexican heritage, as you can tell by the colors. Um, and from the tongue to the insole, you can see that it shows... Paul's love for the boxing. He loves boxing and you can see that through the tongue. It has his name on there too. And he also uses Roman numerals and encrusted stones to mark his 15th year with the brand. A whole 15 years with Nike, that's crazy. And lastly, it comes with a big green Nike swoosh and you know the white upper leather which is all around the shoe. I'm personally not a fan of the SB Dunk Highs. I think they're just kind of like Air Jordan 1s, but uglier, you know? You know what I'm saying? I don't want to diss on it, but I just don't like it. And I mean, for some people, they might love it. I just, I'm just not a fan. The resale aspect of these Dunks, they will probably be on average from 200 to $250, which you can make some good profit if you're able to cop a lot of these. Let's say three or four, you can make some good money. But if you cop one, you can still make some good, decent profit. I don't think they're gonna go any higher than 250, um, and I feel like I'm just overestimating that too. But right now in the pre-sale market, they're like 200 average, which is not bad. Um, they will release via sneakers and most likely on selected SB skate shops since this is a skating shoe. Since Paul also loves skating, so I will leave a link in the description below. For the select skate shops that might be getting these it won't tell you exactly but you could just call up your skate shops see if they have them or we'll be getting them soon i check the foot apps because the foot apps be posting things like one or two days before the drop actually happens which kind of sucks but it's how they roll out but yeah with that being said is this a cop or drop i think this is more like a cop um even if they don't resell for that much you can always return the shoe if you don't want to go through all that hassle you will never lose your money in that aspect because you could just return it and then return every single dime, every single cent you spent on that shoe. So no worries about that. Um, but yeah, with that being said, guys, I will see you guys later. See ya.